Do you see that ugliness right there? That's my Chevy paint coming off. I'm gonna repair that now. I'm just gonna use some primer. I'm also trying to make my panels a little less stark contrast with the vehicle, so I'm painting them white also. I'm just using uh, regular primer paint, Kills brand, K-I-L-L-Z, and I'm having to put a few coats on there. It already rained on me twice, and now that I've been out on a little mini trip in the van, I know what's working and what's not, and these cabinet doors are not staying shut. So this is my second attempt. I've got one of these latches here, um, and it's got a longer bolt on it, so hopefully that'll work. And the screws that came with are much too long, so we're cutting those off. Ooh, look at these sparks flying. Using a little bit of cardboard there, just so that a spark doesn't hit my carpeted walls and set the van ablazing. I am so stupid, I took a chance. It was a gamble. There was a small percent chance that it was going to rain. And it rained again! My second attempt at painting this panels, and it rained again. Found this self-wash carport, and I'm just hanging out here until uh, the rain lets up. If I'm to believe it, it says that it'll stop raining in 40 minutes. We'll see. Hey, I've got thoughts on my mind worth sharing right now. What really annoys me about the two panels that I have in the front there, I love having 400 watts of solar panels, but I don't like how it looks from the front, the two panels in the front. Uh, it gives it an unnatural look. And I'm thinking about cutting out a template th uh, to match what I'm looking for. And I want to bridge that gap that's right in between the two panels. It's not that I want to go stealth with this little mod here. It's more of the fact that it's just not aesthetic. <laughs> it might, it's not appealing to my eye. It's, uh, I don't know, it just doesn't look right. And just for aesthetic reasons, I'd like to you know, tighten it up, make it more, I mean, it's symmetrical, but I kind of want to just make it more uniform. That's maybe it. Hey, this is a nice jacket. Free country. Made in China. <laughs> now that's irony. You know, Scott actually mentioned to me that Static Camper Van channel, check it out, um, mentioned to me that his, uh, what do you call these, rock lights? Um, created some water damage and I, I get that now because I didn't realize these things are actually pretty hot they're warm and you know in a cold climate Seattle area this time of year I could see that creating condensation and that's it caused some water damage to just a little bit of his, his wood in it first cabinets I get it I get it my dream is coming true guys look at this it's one of those Russian style hats let's think should this be my new hat I guess they'll keep your ears nice and toasty. You look like a goofball, but your ears are warm. John in the comments, hey man, we were talking about hats. What do you think about this one? I came up with a rough sketch of what I want my brother to build in the back. Some shelving. There's a lot of wasted space up near the ceiling, and I'd like to have this top shelf to be extended out over the bed a little bit. Hey there here, boys. Look at this. Check out these precision cuts. Look at this. Brother's really doing a good job there. Look at that. Tight. Tight, tight, tight. Tighten that corner. Jesus' voice speaking to us. He spe Jesus speaks through your woodworking. man has got a little case of acne here. Check out all these little white spots here. And it's running. I need to fix that. But I just quickly took some... Uh, primer paint and dabbed all the little rock chips because as I've discovered a lot of people already know this that a little rock chip turns into a great massive crater on your hood and so anyways I primer painted that it doesn't look great up close but from a distance I'll tell you it looks a lot better than the brown that it was it was really uh, standing out and right there like I said up close looks like garbage but from a distance it just looks a lot cleaner also check out the solar panels they sorry about the music the solar panels uh they blend in a lot nicer now pop goes the weasel wow check this out this is all craig jagged up 
using that uh, Craig Jag that I got off Amazon. That looks awesome. Really lightweight construction. Here it is. Check it out. I'm just, my mind is blown right now. I'm just, I'm so excited by this. Seeing a little bit of progress here. It op it's opened up a whole new world in the back of the van here. This was all unused storage space and so much more room for activities, guys. This is going to be awesome. Over here, right now I'm just going to keep it as it is, but later I may cut this and open this up so that I'll have the ability to put really tall stuff back here. And then it goes all the way to the bed. We'll start actually right here. The bed that I have in there is like an old one. It's just a memory topper that sucks. I'll get a proper bed in there at some point. And it's wide enough so Tiffany can be in here. Because as it is right now, it's too tight. We're like sleeping on top of each other. So, or we have to sleep like head to foot, foot to head. That's, that's too much. Um, look at this. This is a good fit, huh? Or a good cut. Yeah, dear. Got a plan up here to put another shelf like right at the top and it's gonna jet out farther. And then you can tuck in like a sleeping bag and stuff. This is gonna be cool, man. I'm stoked. Cave. Same mistake. I think it's barbecue sauce from the far end. Did it have it mislabeled? We have to critically think here and call <laughs> Ask questions. Do you have the ketchup? always question? No, really? it's not mislabeled. Always question what you were like, experiencing. If you look at them, they just both look like ketchup. I didn't read them. It's Heinz okay, both, barbecue you, sauce. You didn't even yeah. pass cafeteria in college, did you? It's so Hey guys, thanks for watching. That was the fun police. Go check them out on YouTube. They're in Tacoma, Washington. If you like the video, give it an up vote. If you haven't subscribed, you know you need to do that.